Last time on Metroid Boomtown, before the Federation, was here. Okay, this is your last mission. Go to the operations room and do the thing. And you have to, whoa, her eyes was like, whoa, and return to your ship and escape. That's like the final boss, which I'm not going to do yet exactly. I'm going to do some more exploring like this way, for instance. I think... I think I'm almost... It used to tell you... Or like, a New Game Plus or some shit like that. It would tell you the percent of items you had in an area. Damn it. I can't go this way? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Yeah, it would, it would tell you the percent of items you had. Or I think like, you have to beat the game first, and then go do stuff. I have to go up. Do I have to do this now? Isn't this like the ending? Well, I'm gonna see what's up with this way first. Um, let's see. I don't know. If it's like a thing where you have to use all the shortcuts to go everywhere now, because some of the doors are locked. Or you do have to do this first. I don't know. I don't really... I know I said I was going to try to get everything I could. But... Yeah, like, I don't remember. I'm just gonna beat the game <laughs> as fast as I can. Well, I'm not speedrunning it, but I took... I did everything I could get on the way to the last part. And, I mean, you don't need everything. Oh, there's a secret entry. Okay. Wait, you have to still... Oh, uh, you have to, like, do this weird puzzle thing. Okay. I mean... I'll do it under certain circumstances as I won't reveal to the world. I'm just gonna save right here. I mean, I'm not saying if you want to see a 100% run, just go fucking watch it, but I just want to beat the game. <laughs> Also, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm not really, okay, who did this? What the hell? Uh, hmm, I guess I'll figure it out. Okay, uh, sorry about that cut. I had to go handle my laundry anyway. Okay, am I almost there yet? At the top. Okay. Alright. Oh. Okay, I guess this is the final episode, probably. Oh, wait, what? Where am I supposed to go? can't go anywhere. What the actual hell? Oh. No! Can't go anywhere. What the fuck? I don't remember this part of the game sucking so bad. Um. Oh. Okay, the saxophone is back with a vengeance. You can freeze her, but you have to damage her with the, uh, a charge shot from your thing. So, like, okay, what you don't want to do is clash with her with the screw attack, because it's not going to end good for you. Because you only take damage. You're the only one who takes damage after that. Get away from me. Also, her ice missile still does a shitload of damage. Now she's like phasing in and out of existence. Ah! 
damn it. Wow. You don't want to do that because you'll lose. If I get hit with that thing again, I'm going to die. No. Okay. All right. Let's go. Okay. All right. Let's go. Okay. All right. Let's go. That's an OG um, We Guess reference. I don't remember what video I did that in. Where I was like, okay. All right. Oh yeah, it was a... Uh, that video is still up, actually. I I think it is. It was amateur beatbox remix of the song is called. Uh, let's save that for later. Okay, so the saxophone turns very not good. The good news is she stops having the ice beam. I have to scratch my nose. Okay, my nose is scratched. Um. She just turns into a freaking monster of, like, Samus. Oh. She also broke my audio, so that's pretty cool. Uh... That's actually super weird. I'm gonna fix that right now. <laughs> um, so the saxophone broke my audio. Or, like, sh somehow made the volume quieter, I guess. But, um, I don't know. I don't think you get her beam, though. Please, can I have this? Oh, okay, thank you. Okay, so you see the saxophone's heart. You try to get it, and it, like, flies away and shit. And you can't go this way anymore. This is all broken. I wonder if the speakers on my headset blew out. I don't know. Hopefully it doesn't change when I'm editing. Oh well. Okay, I have 26 health. I need to guide the entire thing to like dead land. I need this whole thing is gonna explode. Also, I guess this is fun. This is the final video. This is all happening. Wait, I need to do it to that recharge room real fast. Wait, does time go? No, it does not. No, I can't! Fuck! Shit, fuck everything. And no, you can't save during the, uh... Explosion of the world. Um, hopefully you don't run into anything on the way there. That would suck. Okay. I don't think you can actually mess this part up, because your shift's, like, right down there. What's weird is you can't recharge. Oh, okay. How come I couldn't go to the one that was in the first room? Anyway. Finale's coming up. Get hype, please. That's my hype noise brought to you by badnoises.com. Um, written and starring me, Bad Noises Man. I sh my co worker actually said to me once, Andre, I wish I could have an app full of just you making noises, because you make so many fucking noises. And, uh, that was pretty good. I need to take her up on that offer. I don't think he can use this down. Okay. Can't go anywhere else anymore. This part is stupid because of the ground is fucked up. Oh wait, but I think I wasted more time, because you're supposed to also fight the final boss. Okay, so like, see this gross ass thing? This is the Omega Metroid's egg. Um, it's supposed to be like coming up anyway now, alright. This is the Omega Metroid. It's really like, big and disgusting. I don't think you can hit it yet. And it like, kills you <laughs> in one hit. He also screams horribly. You can't... You can, like, jiggle the control pad to make Samus' head move, but you can't do anything. Anyway, the saxophone is back. Yay, saxo! No! No! The saxophone, your favorite character, is dead, I'm sorry to say. But now Samus is, like, combination fusion Metroid hybrid thing. And 
since ice is Metroid's weakness, I, I guess you can't like spot dodge with the morph ball. What am I spot talking about? Smash for this is not. But every time you get hit, you get like stunned, and it's kind of annoying. And I have a minute now. Fucking get back! Get back! Back! I say. Now you can charge the ice beam. But anyway, that was my trade fusion. Brought to you by Nintendo. Also, she has blue hands. Or like, on the other side is blue. But oh wait, no, that's not her hands. That's wait, I'm not sure. That's weird. Anyway, get on the ship. You leave. And you have a good day. Also, this design of Samus is like, I guess, is the one she stays in canonically until Prime, which is like a different. Thing. Cause see this suit is like it has Samus's original colors, but it's different. So supposedly, if they make Metroid 5, she should be in this suit, I think. Yeah, Adam Malkovich character later exploited, explored, exploited in other M. My incredible reunion with Adam may have saved the universe. But how will the beings of the universe view our resolve? I doubt they will understand what we did, but the danger will be very averted. They will hold tribunals and investigations. He's also Dracula now. Um, they will hold us responsible. Adam understood this and he spoke to me in my anger. Do not worry. I mean, <clears throat> Do not worry. One of them must understand. One of them must. I reflected upon these words. Oh, that's not her him anymore. Anyway, we are all bound by experiences. Thanks, thanks for that half-assed epiphany, Samus. Uh, in the end, the human soul will ever reach the truth. Yeah, yeah. Preaching to the choir, and this is what Adam taught me. One detail still bothers me. Why are the ship? Is flying by itself. Why are the ship flying by itself? This is quality closure, folks. Uh, before I faced the Mega Metroid, the ship moved on its own, guided by someone's hands. Is it possible? <gasps> Adam? <gasps> Lady, what's your fucking problem? <laughs> what's troubling you? You wonder how I started the ship? <laughs> Just think about it. They lent me a hand. Oh, 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 it's the animals from Super Metroid. Whoa, whoa, it's a cock it's a cockatrons and blink weeks. And that is number two beaded game by your buddy old pal B. Recorded on footage for all you to exploit for my not well-being because I have said some pretty stuff in here. I don't know math or each of my videos is what like 15 14 minutes long multiply that by 20 and you get 420 um, <laughs> No, you don't don't listen to me. I don't know anything Sometimes I do, but sometimes I don't. But sometimes I do, and I do more times than I don't, and that's more important. Thanks, Mike. The only real name here. <laughs> and executive producer, Iwata Satoru. Iwata Satoru. Uh, we're going to make another Metroid game. Metroid 5? Metroid Dread? Which one is it? Okay, so this is Samus. New Samus. This is her, like... Also, this is, like, the worst ending. Because you don't get her, like, bikini suit or whatever. And, like, this design of Samus is, like, all sleek and liquidy and stuff. Except for those spikes on her arms. Okay, I got half of it. I got half <laughs> of everything. Anyway, that's Metroid Fusion. Um... Join me next time when I play another jump and shoot game. Even though by the time this comes out, I'm still in the middle of a cave story. So watch me finish that. Okay, bye.